changes for Detroit's historic former train station in Corktown today. Crown Enterprises announced the sale to Ford Motor Company. And 7 Action News reporter Naya Harden was there to take a look at what this could mean for Detroit. For three decades, the depot has sat here empty, fenced off, and in the dark. Now that Ford has taken ownership, the future of the Michigan Central Station seems bright. The deal is complete. The future of the depot is assured. Monday morning, Matthew Maroon announced that Ford Motor Company is the new owner of the Michigan Central Station. To business owners like Ken Kohler, this is a dream come true. You know, this area is very alive already as it is, and it's, it's, it's only going to make it even more so. Uh, their presence here, I think, is awesome. He remembers when the Amtrak was running here. As a kid going inside and, and seeing it, I mean, it was awesome back then. In 1992, Crown Enterprises bought the building during Detroit's decline. While there were a lot of ideas for the station, nothing was put into action. My father and I were quite alone left only with a positive long-term vision that no one else could see. Maroon says the depot will become a shiny symbol of Detroit's progress and success. I knew that this was exactly what the building needed, the golden opportunity for its rebirth, the American second chance. Back in May, Ford said they were expanding their presence in Corktown by moving its electric vehicle and autonomous vehicle business teams into a refurbished former factory. Ken says his store will be ready for whatever Ford brings next. You know, we're going to have to redo what we're doing because, again, there's going to be a lot of people working here. We're going to have to make sure that we're taking care of, you know, the customers as always. Ford will announce their plans for the station next Tuesday at 11 a.m. right here in Corktown. Nia Harden, 7 Action News.